Across the waters from Scotland, far beyond the Isle of Skye, lies the barren, rocky island of Harris. A hundred and fifty years ago, the people of this island created a unique cloth, a hand-woven tweed that was to become world famous. And so it is today, known simply as Harris Tweed. It all began in 1846 when a poor crofter, Norman MacLeod, made his way to Stornoway, a busy herring port on the Isle of Lewis, and from here took a boat to Scotland. The purpose of his journey was to show his daughter's tweed to Lady Dunmore, whose family owned the island. So enchanted by this intricate, beautiful tweed, Lady Dunmore journeyed to Harris to see Norman's daughters, Christine and Marion, in the remote island croft. And so it began. Having commissioned a large supply of tweed, Lady Dunmore then introduced it to the outside world, and in no time, it became fashionable, worn by dukes and kings and film stars. And to this day, no single company can own Harris Tweed. It belongs, as it always has done, to the islanders. It is amazing to think that in this mechanized, mass-produced world, the tweed made solely on this island is still woven by hand.